Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are doing the level 75 myth spell quest um, from Halston, which is a minion. No new land. Beautiful day, isn't it? I hope I didn't take you away from anything urgent. I had a whammy of an idea and wanted to shout with you. I think your duels would be well complimented by a new minion. What do you think? I came across this compendium of minions someone left behind in class. Hmm, let's look up your specialization. Vasanji Law Singer? Goodness me, that's a powerful minion to entrust to a student. Well, I'm sure Cyrus knows what he's doing. I have a good friend called the Professor. He travels all the spiral, but you can find him by his telegraph box in Marleybone. Find the Professor and ask him to teach you the summoning ritual for your new minion, Vasanji Law Singer, the Elephant Soldier. Right, Visanji is who we are getting. Let's quickly equip this quest. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Um, and we will head over to Regent Square and get this lovely minion. Um, I have done the other two um, in Avalon. We are currently level 75. Um, have done the other two, the level 72 and the other level 75 spell quest um, on stream. And they'll be on my second channel, so link in the description for that. You, you should know the deal by now. Um, Marley Bone, let's go. But I thought I would do this one because it's a little bit more important, I guess, is, is the word. A little bit more important. Um, and expand the lore a little bit more than the other ones. Plus, there, you know, there's not many things about the minions. And minions are cool, and that's kind of what myth is. So we're doing it here. Here, hello. I also needed a video because I'm halfway through editing like three of them. So yes, <laughs> I just needed a video. Right, Professor, hello. Why, hello there. Hmm, I wonder. Aha! Let me guess. You are after a new minion, right? I knew it. And by the stitch of your clothes, I'll hazard you are a conjurer, no? Wait, have I deduced this all before? Travel to Crab Alley and find King Thermidor. Get his permission to search the Tower of Peladon in the Deep Warrens. You'll have to fight whatever has moved into that dank place for the Conjuring Globe of Peladon. Bring it back to me. Right, let us... Uh, we'll leave a mark here. Might as well. I don't want to walk all the way back. Let's head to Crab Alley real fast. And we're going to be fighting a thing. Is it myth? Let's find out. It is um, not myth, so that's cool. Let's go to Crab Alley. Man, it's been so long since I've been in Crab Alley. Whoa, all those years ago. I say years because it has been years since I was in Crab Alley on this character. So, so, so long ago. We're also just rocking the carpet at the moment. Because um, this is technically the mount that I'm officially meant to be using. You see, I have official mounts. It's pretty cool. Um, and this is technically my official mount for the stitch. And I like it a lot. I really like this carpet. For those of you who don't know, this carpet is from um, when Mirage was released. If you had a membership during Mirage releasing, which was what, 2016? Yeah, 2016. Um, I think it's 2016. Yeah, 2016. Um, you got a free carpet, which is pretty cool. I wish they would do more of that. I really do, because they're cool. Just having these cool Wii mounts that you get for free just for having membership or playing during a release i think that is cool also if it's like actually themed to the world as well um uh, it's pretty cool i'm s i'm sad that they didn't do one for caramel it would have been cool if they did because yes because yes but no it does not happen i forget we can use these i forget we can use these because these didn't used to be a thing and now they are a thing we can't use that teleporter we have got to use the teleporter down here because yes again yes 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 good job makes sense and then just over to the rope ladder. Kablamo. Young wizard, Sir Homer Sunblade can get you into Crab Alley. Go see him at his storm mill on Triton Avenue and help him out. Weird. Um, we, we can get into Crab Alley because I've already done this before. Okay. <laughs> okay, I've already done this. I don't need an explanation of what's happening. I've already done this. Otherwise, I wouldn't be allowed the quest. Halston is an interesting, interesting guy. King Thermidor, hello. We welcome you back to Crab Alley, dearest, closest friend wizard. Uh, what was your name again? Oh, of course, we will never forget what you did. Now, 
What can the illustrious King of Crab Alley do for you today? The Tower of Peladon? That place is haunted and forsaken and forbidden. But for you, we'll lift the ban. Go forth, plucky wizard, into the Tower of Peladon and find that which you seek. He, he's a weird speaker. I always forget this. I always forget this. Right, let's go to the find the globe of Peladon and the Tower of Peladon. I'm sure there's nothing terrible that we have to defeat there. Oh, we, we might have to defeat a lot of things. Spoiler alert. Whoopsies. Shouldn't have said that. But hey, let's let's do this. Oh man, I remember questing through here and I absolutely struggled with those Nith guys. They were the worst things ever. They were so bad. So, so, so bad. Um, right. I'm surprised they didn't update this bit with the graphical reworks. It could really use some. At least I didn't think it was. Maybe it was. Maybe it was, but it still looks bad. No, it must have been. Surely. No, it must have been. It must have been. I'm just bad and don't realize. Wretched wizard, the sea will flow into your nose and mouth and swallow you whole. The salt and black take you forever. Okie dokie, Giddies seems to be by himself. Um, he does not have a minion, so that's a great we whatever we can do, we'll, we'll do. Let's blade, let's blade. Um, so yeah, there's there's been a lot that's happening on my myth. I'm doing a lot more on him because I need to quest him a lot more. So that's cool. I will be doing an eight-hour stream, and not next week, but the week after when you're seeing this. Um, basically and and it'll be just eight hours of myth questing and we're gonna see how far we get currently we're in Avalon we have only really just started we have just gone through a bit of the wild um, yeah so that's fun the wild is okay and then we, we have you know Dundara the weird the, the other places um, Lakeshore catacombs and then we finish that and then into Azteca which is crazy as well. Oh, we could ninja pigs. Oh, if we get an enchant, we're definitely ninja piggy, ninja pigging because it is so good. Ninja pigs is my favorite spell to use on this character. It's just such a cool spell, and I really, really enjoy using it. It's amazing. I'm so happy I farmed. I spent hours and hours and hours farming for it, but I would really like to just get it. But we're gonna do this just so we can crit a little bit more, a little bit more crit, and a little bit more little bit more pierce which is always good just to get through his um fortify we might even put up an infall if i didn't discard it i know i discarded something i was hoping i discarded the right thing could have discarded the wrong thing or the right thing and the wrong thing i can't remember it happens let's find out am i good or am i bad i am good let's infall and then we'll hit and hopefully kill. This should be way overkill because we do boost as well. But just to be sure, just to be sure, we're going to just go full, full force. Full force for it. It should be good though. Oh, we have Medusa as well. What's really funny is Medusa is like, you know, only slightly better. Only slightly better than Ninja Pigs. The only good thing about Medusa is the two round stun. Really. Otherwise, I would just prefer to use ninja pigs. It just makes so much more sense. So much more sense. But that's fine. Right, here we go. GG. No doubt GG. Because we are just way too good at this. Way too good at this whole myth thing. We're just way too good. See, watch this. Kablamo. Kablamo. Easy clap. Nice work. You don't see the globe of Peladon. Perhaps you should explore deeper into the tower. Oh my gosh, I forgot that. I forgot the narrations. Oh my gosh. It's been so long since hey, I've heard the narrator. What's this? A spy for Cromshell? You say you aren't. Of course, that's what any good spy would say. Whether you are a spy or not, you will pay for disrupting my plans. I don't know what your plans are, but sure thing. Sure thing, buddy. Let's just destroy you. That's what I think we should do um uh, let's enchant this for now might as well I'm gonna do this he has 4,800 health not too much um 
considering we did what like 9,000 last time with three blades I, I don't think we need to worry too much about this I should really get some cleansers on this character maybe I do that I should do that after this I should do that I should actually get some cleansers that would be a fantastic idea I think a really fantastic idea because I don't think I have any do I have any I don't have any I don't carry cleanse why do I not carry cleanse man I'm weird so weird so weird i just focus too much on my death wizard and then all the other wizards are like they're like low level weakness isn't a big deal and then they're like you know an avalon weakness is a little bit of a deal oh well um hmm let's see if we can do this and get another blade maybe that would be cool if not we'll just hit with an orth um because that does more than a frog it probably won't kill but we do get another blade is it different it is different so that's fantastic if we get a better thing next round other than an orth and a frog if we get like a medusa or an ninja pigs i will definitely use that otherwise we'll just hit oh we got a medusa even better let's do that he's probably stun immune but whatever 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 if he isn't, he's stunned for two rounds. And if he is, well, that, that was to be expected anyway. We're just hitting to get some damage. Just a little bit of damage. So we can finish off with something else. Because I don't think this is going to kill. It could. But I doubt it. I mean, we do have, we do have like, three sort of blades, I guess. Okay. GG. We did. Nice. Easy clap. Easy peasy. Hey, gads, I'm done for. Take the conjuring globe of Peladon back to your round head masters. I'll flee into exile and bide my time. Alright. Let's get this globe. The conjuring globe of Peladon thrums powerfully with myth energy. And we'll go back to the Regent's Square. And talk to the professor. Talk to the professor. Ah, I see you have been busy. Let's see the conjuring globe of Peladon. Very dangerous. Now let me teach you the summoning ritual. Head to Zafaria and find Kilimon Copperleaf in the Baobab Library. Ask him where to find the Kasbah of Zanj. I mixed it up with the Kasbah's guardians once. Barely got out with my skin, I think. Defeat the Kasbah's guardians so you can perform the summoning ritual using the globe of Peladon. Best of luck, eh? Let me know how it goes. Okay, let's leave a mark here again. And we are at Kilman. Hello, hello, hello. Jumbo, young wizard. What brings you back to Zafaria? You are searching for the Kasbah of Zanj? You will find that cursed tower in Stone Town. It fell to the warlord Varos, a cold blooded gorilla. I have a scroll that will unlock the Kasbah of Zanj, but the rest is up to you. Okie dokie, let's head to the globe pedestal, which is in Stone Town by the looks of it. So just head back here real fast and quickly use the teleporter to Stone Town. Because that is the best option. Um, Stone Town, boom. Easy peasy. Love to see it. And this way, this way, this way, this way, it is this house here. Wow. I wonder what was this house. I wonder what was in this house. It's not this, this, not that. But we stand in the in between, wizard. We will both be changed by this duel forever. Who will we be after? That's a great question, my friend. One that I really do not know the answer to. So I'm glad you're asking the deep philosophical ones that we love. Right, Vasanji. Let's destroy you. I'm sorry, buddy, but it has to happen. It just has to happen. Luckily, we got a prism pretty quickly. He doesn't have that much health. He really doesn't. I'm surprised. Unless I was reading that wrong, he doesn't have that much health. Surely I was reading that wrong, right? Surely. Surely I am. Right? Right? Okay, I was not. He does only have 1,600 health. I was... That's what I thought I saw, and then I'm like, surely he doesn't have that low health. Surely it's like 7,000 or something, and I just mistook the one for a 7. But no, 
It's just 1,000. He is not even good. What, he's, what, rank 9 boss? Rank 7 boss. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. But still. What? What? I'm so confused. I don't even... Like, just one blade or Thoris will kill. That's all I need. This is literally all I need. <laughs> what the heck? What? What, what, what? I am so confused. So confused. Crit, lovely. No block, even better. Kablam. Bye. That did way too much. To defeat the warlord Varos, you will need strength of spell and speed of mind. Good luck, wizard. Hmm, okay. What's weird is when I did this on my death, I think it was they a little... say it is folly to challenge a wizard. Tomorrow, prudence shall be our watchword. Today, I shall soak the land in blood. Yeah, okay. I'm not going to complain about this, because this looks a little bit harder. I was going to say, on my death, I swear this was, like, actually kind of difficult. And so far, it has not been very difficult at all. But what does this man's do? He, okay, we boost on him. This is good. He doesn't cast Smith Shield. Like, okay, I'm so confused. I am a little bit confused, not gonna lie. He only has 5,200 health. Wow. Wow. He used to have 6,500. That hasn't been changed in the wiki. Interesting. Um. Yeah, that's weird. So weird. We can just Medusa as soon as we can and kill. We'll go for a Bewilder, though. We will do a Bewilder. Sounds like a good idea. A good, good, good idea. He's passing. Fair enough. Good idea. Good idea, my friend. Um, We'll do this so we don't fizzle. I would have loved, actually, another blade, to be honest. But, hey, whatever. We should kill, I think. I'm pretty sure we'll kill. Pretty sure. Kraken. Uh-oh. Ah, all spaghetti -os. This gonna be hurt. Kablam. Just a little bit of hurt. Man, if only that did one less damage. It would have been so funny. Ha ha, funny. I didn't even need potions for this fight. What? I wasted all that time getting potions, and I didn't even need them. I want a refund. Just kidding. They'll be fine for... They'll be perfect for questing again, but still. But still, I demand a refund. Refund on my potions. Not good enough. Kablam. And GG. Easy clap. <sighs> Battening a wizard. What a stupid thing to do. Here, you've earned this conjuring globe of Peladon. Okie dokie. Ped is still. You place the conjuring globe of Peladon upon the pedestal and perform a summoning ritual. Something is happening. You have defeated Warlord Varus and unlocked his secrets. I would be honored to assist you whenever the need arise. Right, let's head to um, the professor once more. And then that is that. That is all she wrote for this quest. Worlds come and go, stars perish, matter disperses, coalesces, forms into other patterns. Nothing can be eternal. Sorry, I was thinking of someone else. Did you free Vasanji Law Singer from the cruel warlord Varos? That line before is kind of weird. That's. Hmm. Let me show you the spell to summon Vasanji. It requires tact and finesse. Fortunately, I am blessed with both. All this spellcraft makes me hungry. Here, have a jelly baby. Right. Fantastic. There we go. That is Vasanji. He is a minion. He is a minion of um, myth. Um, rank 6, no PvP, similar to the other minions that you get at this level. Um, Melduit for death. Um, 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 yeah, just, just a whole bunch of the other ones as well. Surely you would know by now. Um, but yeah, otherwise, <laughs> that is all we have time for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. If you want more videos on my myth, go down to the description and uh, look there for the second channel. There's a whole bunch, there's a whole playlist of my myth adventures. But otherwise, remember to craft outside the box.